Hughes Nursery. So, I'm here again, lovely. Yesterday was the first day of autumn. It's summer has barely come and gone. It's just been so quick in the garden, so many things happening, apart from the tomatoes here. And unfortunately, there's only four ripening at the moment. I'm really hoping for some more to ripen, but if not, we can always make green tomato chutney, which apparently is really tasty, so I can't wait for that. We've also got quite a few little courgettes on their way. I'll be showing you, hopefully, in a later video harvesting courgettes. We just made a batch of courgette chutney, but uh, I'll hopefully maybe make a video on that on my other channel, which is called Hughes Cooking. And basically, let's get down to it to make to not to make but to transplant my honey mango so let's see what it looks like so there's my honey mango it's always been growing this way with quite troopy leaves but by far now it really does desperately need transplanting so take a look at that brand new roots coming through really excited about it and yeah it's doing really well so look at the leaves nice long stem so let's transplant it now I must ha go and get some new mangoes to start growing as again so I'm going to start off just using our general organic compost that we've made in our garden I don't want the compost that I brought as it's really bad quality so I'm just going to use this so I'll just maybe change this camera angle for you looking down a bit more there we go place it like that that looks about right and then scoop around I'm going to leave part of the seed uncovered so it looks quite nice like that push it down lightly and you'll be hearing some strange like sort of sort of sounds uh, that's bird scares because we have raspberries that are just beginning to come out autumn fruiting raspberries really nice yellow raspberries so there we have it we have my honey mango transplanted and that was very quick easy I'm just going to keep you updated on this okay I must do that. It's looking very good in there. I'll probably be keeping it in the house because yesterday it went to down to 0 0.3 degrees Celsius, which is basically 0 0.3 degrees away from a frost. So we did have a ground frost, but not an air frost. So I think this will do better in my bedroom for the winter. So thanks a lot for watching. Just check out the two usual channels that I say, Kiwi Grower and Garden Frugal, really good channels, definitely check them out, really worth a sub, and I'll definitely keep you updated with this. Also, I'm getting, it's only like, just under 300 subscribers till I reach a thousand, so just help me out please, I'm almost a target now, is to try and get that by Christmas, do you think I'm going to do it? I don't know, we'll have to find out. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.